you'll find the Corel Connect icon on the Artwork Canvas page. Corel Connect is designed to help you manage your graphics. Just click on the icon and the Connect dialog opens up and it lets you browse on your computer and take a look in different folders. You can save any folder on your hard drive into your favorites folder. Drag, hold, and then you would drop it. And if you would like to see the contents of that folder, you can just click on it and it will allow you to filter vectors and bitmap images. So if I want to see if these are vectors, I have vector, the ability to see vectors is turned on. If I deselect the icon, I can no longer see vectors and that means that these are not bitmap images. These files are actually vector files. Now you'll find if this dialog box hides from you, it likes to stay out of your way. Take it and grab it by its title bar and you can pull it over and dock it here just by setting it inside of the Docker panel. And then you'll see you have a Connect icon and you'd see that also in Windows, Docker, and Connect up here. At any time, you can pull this Connect dialog right back out onto the screen again. And you also have the opportunity to activate the tray. And you'll see the tray down below. I can move this up so we can see items in the tray. And any of the graphics that I might like to use for later, I can take and drag into a tray. I can keep different trays. So I might have this one to keep a nature graphic in and drag different graphics down into that tray. I can not only look at folders that are on my computer or on removable media like a CD or a DVD that you might have with graphics on it, you can look on websites. So I can put the website that I'd like to visit up in the title bar and click on the search icon and it will show me any of the graphics that are on that web page. Again, I can sort if I want to see if these are vectors or bitmaps. If I deselect vectors, I'm would not be able to see any vector graphics. That tells me these are all bitmap images. If I'd like to use or save one of these graphics, I simply have to click, hold down your mouse and drag it either onto the workspace. It will prompt you that you want to be careful of copyright infringement. And I know that this is a copyright free design. I could also take one of these designs and drag it down into my tray so that I have it for later use and it will sit right here in my tray and even if I'm not online the graphics available for me to just click and drag up into my workspace for use in my design.